Why did I choose to come here? This is so exciting to talk about. People said it was a great school, like I only heard good things. I love the environment, it's really warm. The teachers and the students have a really nice relationship. Being in school is fun for me. Just like the fact that it's all girls, it's like a judgment-free place. I loved how when I came to Maya Note, everyone was so welcoming and it seemed that they loved to be here and that's the kind of environment I wanted to be where people were happy to come to school every day. I meet a lot of friends in Maya Note. Our group is really united. Everybody's looking out for you. Everybody cares and everyone has relationships with people in other grades. If you walk through the hallways, you really feel like it's it's your home. Going into ninth grade, a lot of people are really nervous. They don't know how it's going to work out with friends. In my note, it's not like that. My note does a really good job with making you feel so comfortable. You come and you have a trip, you have freshman day, and you bond with your whole grade. When I was a freshman, like I didn't have so many friends, and then like Mishmover, you get to like meet everyone. Mishmover is like like 12 hours where everyone's together and we're all just like having a crazy fun time. But really what happens at Mishmover is an incredible amount of learning that gets done. You get to learn Torah while having ice cream parties, there are pillow fights. Like there's always dancing and singing. We're excited about singing and having kumzitzes. They inspire each other. They sing and they share their Torah. And to watch a student's eyes light up, you know, a student who's afraid to speak up in the classroom, but who gets up in front of 400 people out of Shabbaton, you can't describe that. I love Shabbaton. Everybody stays up and hangs out with each other, and you get to know people from other grades. I love it. It's a perfect mix of the love for Israel and the love for Torah. Israel is a significant part of my note, and we have programs on Yom Hazikaron and Yom Asmut. What I would like to take out of Maya Note is leadership skills. Why do I like to work at Maya Note? Because part of what Maya Note structures itself around is that empowerment of women. What does it mean to be a woman in the 21st century? In Maya Note, there's a real stress on student empowerment because they really want you to feel like you can become a part of your future and you're really the one controlling your future. If there's a program here that you want and they don't have it, like start it. It brings you to your max potential. Mino has made me more comfortable to take on leadership roles. Last year, it was a girl whose mom wanted her to have a bat mitzvah but couldn't afford it. We ran a bat mitzvah program. So they went and they really decorated, they went all out, they got volunteers to come help, and we threw her a bat mitzvah. Her mom was like crying at the end, basically saying like this was the most amazing thing. Like two high school students were able to make this happen with you know, the assistance of the school. Whatever extracurriculars you're interested in, they have here, and if they don't have it, then it's up to you to start it. I'm on the soccer team, the debate team. I'm on the hockey team, mock trial. I was the stage manager for the musical. They have singing and dancing performance called Heartbeats. Since we're in all girls school, we can really be really close with each other. It allows them to shine and to grow in ways that they couldn't otherwise necessarily do in a co-ed school. I love learning in my note, it's so fun. They want you to succeed. The teachers really want to help you. We don't really look at our teacher just as our teacher. We look to them as someone who like helped form who we want to be as a person. We're very open and transparent. Our windows are wide open. Our doors are wide open. Students just stop by and want to have a conversation. The teachers really care about how you're doing in school. It's also an incredibly rigorous academic institution. Mayano gives you the skills that you need to tackle the challenges that we don't know exist yet. I want my students to become critical thinkers about the world that they live in. They ask hard questions. That when a student asks a question in class that's really on her mind, that's the point at which you just close the book and continue that conversation. Academically, I feel very well prepared for college. I've had amazing teachers. I've taken challenging classes. If you ask me what is my main goal for my students is to leave as inspired Jews. Understanding why Torah is important, why living life as a Jew is important. Let's say you're learning like Gemara. They find a way to like make it connect to you. I I hope that my students leave my note with a belief that they have something unique to contribute to the world and to live meaningful lives, to live lives in which the Torah continues to be the core. A family that's looking to allow their daughter to flourish, that is what a Mayanot family is. I feel like I've really become a real person here. The students are great, the teachers are great. If you learn in high school how to become a leader and how to start things on your own, then you'll really be able to be much more successful in the future. The idea of understanding your own power and your own potential is something that Mayano really gives you. You can be anyone you want to be.